Hi, my name is Dr. Vinod Rana. Today, we are going to talk about post-exposure prophylaxis. What is post-exposure prophylaxis? Post-exposure prophylaxis is a system of drugs which are given to the patient when he is exposed to the STD or HIV. So, what can be the causes? If a patient has gone to the massage parlor or if he had a sex with a sex worker or if he had a sex with a partner with multiple sex partners. In that case, if the patient who had the exposure with that person comes to us within 72 hours of golden time, we can put that patient on a therapy called PEP therapy, post-exposure prophylaxis. So there are different type of PEPs. 2 drug therapy, 3 drug therapy, 4 drug therapy and 5 drug therapy. Initially when the PEP was started, there was a drug by the name called Trovada. It was used, it was a 2 drug therapy. But nowadays that trend has changed. We nowadays do not use Trovada at all. Nowadays, the trend has changed. We are using 3-drug therapy, 4-drug therapy or 5-drug therapy. If a patient had a high risk of the infection, so what does it mean? If a patient had sex with the sex worker with multiple partners, and if the patient is having infection, not of the single stain with multiple stains, there are stains from Asia, from Africa, from America, and there is HIV-1 and there is HIV-2. So there are different stains. And sometimes there are stains which are resistant in nature. So that time, we have to use a good PEP, a very strong PEP. So that PEP is of four drugs. We have to use two drugs from the primary level and two drugs from the secondary level. For example, if the patient is HIE positive and she's a sex worker and by some means she had left the drugs she or he was taking the medicine and had left the drugs the primary drugs which he was taking for ART and he had left so what will happen the stain which will be available in that person will become resistant to HIV so that stain of virus will be called resistant HIV and if that stain comes to the patient who had sex with her or him, then the primary drugs will not work. So that time you have to use the secondary drugs. So guys, please, for God's sake, don't use PEP drugs which are available online. Don't do self-medication. Don't do self-treatment because it can be very fatal. These are very toxic drugs. These are to be used amicably. These are to be used judicially. Their distribution should be very classy because if you are not using proper drug, you can get infected. And believe me, once you are infected, you are infected for life.
सो गाइज माई रिक्वेस्ट इज प्लीज डों टेक एनी ट्रीटमेंट विच इज अवेलेबल ऑन गूगल जस्ट गो टू ए मेडिकल प्रैक्टिशनर गो टू अ पैप स्पेशलिस्ट गो टू एच आई स्पेशलिस्ट एच आई स्पेशलिस्ट इज अ डॉक्टर हु इज ट्रीटिंग एच आई because he knows what are the pros and cons of the treatment so my request to you is please for god's sake not at all don't use self medicated drugs in prp or pap go to the specialist we have to find out what is the body weight of the person what is the bmi where to found number of things then only we can put him on proper drugs so guys if you are a health worker if you are a doctor if you are a any person who is dealing with hazardous things if you had a prick you went to somewhere you had a prick from the syringe you are walking on the road you had a prick on your shoes and you find the syringe it can be contaminated because the people who use drugs they throw these syringes on the roads so be cautious they are infected they can have the virus so if you are infected by that if you are having a prick you have to go to a doctor and if you are a health worker you are working in a hospital and you got a prick you have to take the pap so guys the icd classification of the diseases says that the pap is to be taken within 72 hours so which drug is to be taken is to be decided by the physician because these are category h drugs they are not freely available in the market only a certified doctor can give you those medicines so my request is in case you had an exposure please go to the doctor go to physician go to a qualified doctor who can give you the proper medication and these drugs should be started within first 72 hours that the golden time if you are not doing these treatment is this treatment you can get infected my name is dr vinod rana this is an educational video for the patients if you have got any queries any questions you can just write me you can just ping me my mail address is given here you can subscribe my channel you can like this video and you can send me comments if anything you want to know from my side you can call me there is a number or you can write in the comments we will try to make the video for that disease guys please be safe and let us pray to god up to 9 2030 we should make india a hiv free country Thank you